is the Vivor commercial meat grinder all that it's cracked up to be? It came in. Let's check it out and let's see. They've got it very well packed in, y'all. So it was packed well. It wasn't really damaged. Uh, we've got some operating instructions. So this is going to be part one, the unboxing, and actually checking things out and seeing if it's uh, if it at least feels like all the reviews that I saw on this thing were really good. So I had to try it out. I've been looking for a good meat uh, grinder. We're wanting to start grinding our own meat. It's just healthier, y'all. You just, you're able to control, quality control. Quality control for us right now, 2024, means a lot because we don't know what's going in all of our meat now. So uh, it is kind of heavy. It is heavy, so it does feel like a commercial meat grinder. I just didn't, I didn't want to get, uh, you know, I'm not sponsored by Vivor yet. Uh, but I really did, ooh, Lord, y'all. It's like really heavy, so I'm kind of wounded in my back, but I've had spinal fusion surgery, so it's kind of stout. My wife's grabbing the box. So, it's very, very, very heavy. Oh. So let's see if we can get this thing out of here. Ha. Oh. And I wanted something that did, I'm not planning on putting this thing uh, like up. I'm planning on leaving it out on part of our uh, counter space that's not just completely in the kitchen. So I don't have to, I don't have to move it. And I wanted something that kind of matched our stainless steel. And so there we go. So y'all, one of the reasons that I got this was because of the neck. Now you can get, you can spend way more money. I only spent, this is, uh, today is May. If you're watching this video, today's May the 13th, 2024. Uh, it came in Saturday and I'm just now opening it. And I'm impressed with at least how it feels. So we've got our on off. I don't want to scratch up. It does have rubber feet. It's not going to move. So we've got our on off. It's got a, a, a pretty decent long little cord. It's got the instructions. But I was really impressed with the neck. Some of the cheaper ones, uh, this one didn't cost me but $245 because I signed up for the Vivor Pro account. Saved me like 5% doing that. Uh, it comes with the two different size. This is the one that I will probably use most of the time. This is the larger holes for the larger cut uh, or ground meat. Uh, and this is the smaller one right here. That's for, I will probably use this more for sausage for, of, or if my wife wants the ground meat even finer, you know, ground up, double ground. Oh, uh, it comes with two cutting blades. I have to put my glasses on and make sure y'all that these things are put in right because if you turn them the wrong way, they will cut into your metal and you'll start seeing if it goes in like this, you it'll cut into the inside of your, uh, your neck and it'll start you'll start getting metal shavings in so it came with the two cutting blades both of them are number 12s oh but make sure they go in right now we're gonna have to uh, sanitize if you will before we use it today we're not gonna be grinding nothing because we're gonna actually teach ourselves and find out what meat our roast or sirloin or whatever we want to grind extra fat bacon trimmings uh, and we're gonna make our own combinations that we just like that my wife says that's a good hamburger oh everything comes out now everything in this one is metal that's why i bought it the only plastic piece that i know of is the push of uh, for the meat to go in now i don't know about how everything i didn't go into depth on the motor i do think i remember seeing something about an all copper wound uh, so that's good, uh, if, if that's what I read. Now the neck uh, actually does unbolt 
to be able to clean everything off or out. So you will have to, uh, you know, unbolt the neck and actually to be able to get it clean, which that's okay too. Uh, it's just three little bolts. I'll take my ratchet and take it loose <clears throat> whenever I need to, uh, to do that. A little salad oil. We're probably, I think we're gonna take some spray. We're gonna take some spray and we're gonna spray into it like some coconut spray, olive oil spray, avocado spray, something of that nature to lube it up while before we start using it so it'll help clean better. Uh, but you will have to clean this neck. So I'm gonna do a little bit more research and see if uh, how or what. Now it may not get past the auger. I'm assuming that it's gonna get in there though and it's still gonna get dirty. So to me, I want to be able to clean this, so I'm going to do a little, and I only see the three little nuts, because there's no other way this thing is coming off. It's just not. So, I'll have to check into that uh, and see it. But, you've got your tray. Oh, everything looks really good, y'all. I'm, in, I'm impressed. I'm impressed with the, uh, the feel of it, the weight of it. I don't think this is gonna matter. Like I said, we're gonna get everything go closed up or, or cleaned up before we use it. And it's, you can get more. I didn't order the one that comes with the sausage stuffer. You have to order that separately. But for $200, $245, oh, this thing feels like a beast. So we're gonna see. So we're gonna, oh, we're gonna be trying it out as soon as my wife's saying, well, I need to go find uh, the roast that's on sale, the pork loin, I mean the pork butt, uh, the Boston butt that I want for my sausage. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope you get a good look at it because, can you see the screen? Yeah. Oh, this thing is the real deal. This is not, and y'all, this is, oh, I'm telling you, you can see down I don't forgot, I think this is a two and a half inch. Uh, this is a two and a quarter or a two inch neck. You're gonna be able to grind up whatever you wanna grind up in this, especially right here at home. Uh, and that's what we're gonna do. And we're gonna try to save us some money, plus eat a little healthier along the way. So I'm Craig with the Bickums. I hope you enjoyed this with the Vivor uh, commercial meat grinder. And I hope that I can come back on here and give y'all some more videos that will make you help you make up your mind if you've been looking for one to see if it's gonna uh, work out. So y'all stay tuned for part two. We will see y'all on the next video. Uh, y'all have a blessed day. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button. Give us a like, give us a, a thumbs up and share the video with somebody y'all. Uh, it helps us grow. So we thank y'all. We will see you on the next video. Bye y'all.